In this video, we are going to set up a ProTrack transporter for 8-inch operation. Before you begin, gather all the necessary parts and tools. Place the motor body upside down on a work surface and start by putting the base plate with the tread mounting plates attached in place on the motor body so that the end of the base plate with the four inset screw holes is lined up with the matching holes on the motor body. The four base plate holes should be inset on the side facing you. Use four 732nd screws to attach the base plate to the motor body using an Allen wrench. The tops of the screws will be flushed with the surface of the base plate when tightened. Now rotate the transporter assembly so that the left side of the unit is facing up. Insert the smaller track drive coupler into the track drive on the motor body, being careful to align the pins into the receiver slots. Place the shorter brass spacer between the left tread mounting plate and the motor body and align it with the top screw hole at the end of the tread mounting plate. Insert a quarter 20 screw in the aligned screw hole, being careful to go through the brass spacer, and tighten the screw with a hex wrench. Take the left tread drive assembly and align the spring pin on the inside end of the tread drive assembly with the slot on the track drive coupler. Then swing the tread drive assembly into place, making sure to line up the two inside holes of the assembly with the corresponding holes in the tread mounting plate. Insert two 3-8 screws into the inside holes connecting the tread drive assembly and tread assembly plate and tighten with a hex wrench. Now rotate the entire assembly so that the right side is facing up. Insert the large track drive coupler into the track drive on the right side of the motor body. Place the longer brass spacer between the right tread assembly plate and the motor body and align it with the screw hole that is at the back of the tread assembly plate. Insert a quarter 20 screw in the screw hole, being careful to go through the brass spacer and tighten with a hex wrench. Align the spring pin on the inside end of the tread drive assembly with a slot on the track drive coupler, then swing the tread drive assembly into place. Insert two 3 8 screws into the tread drive assembly and tighten with a hex wrench. Return the transporter assembly to the upright position. Your ProTrack transporter is now set up for 8-inch pipe. At this point, it is a good idea to check your treads for proper tension. Step-by-step -step instructions for checking and tightening ProTrack treads are contained in another video. Be sure to check out our other instructional videos, and our support teams are always happy to assist you at 1-800-767-1974 or 1-859-499-0122.